Hey, all right. Welcome back to the Mr. Excel Netcast. I'm Bill John. Today's question sent in by Mike from Oklahoma City. Mike has a workbook where he says he has a whole bunch of different defined names, and most of those names are now not in use. They're not. They're resolving to reference errors. He said he'd like to get rid of all of them. Something short of going into insert name define choosing the name and clicking delete and going through again and again and again. So an easy way to do this is just a short little three line macro. I want to press Alt F11 to get over to the Visual Basic Editor and we'll go to Insert Module, Sub, let's call it uh, DEL Names and here's the three lines for each NM, that's a variable in Active Workbook dot names NM dot delete Delete is the method that actually will delete that and then say next and M. Basically, we could run that code and it would go through and delete every single defined name in the workbook in a second. Now, I bet though that we don't really want to delete all the names, just the ones that are evaluating to reference errors. So I'm not sure how to do that, but we can learn. I'm going to press F8 to run this macro one line at a time. And once I get into NM, I'm going to right click and choose Add Watch. Here's what we get in the watch window. It basically shows us one line, but you want to click the plus sign and now we can see all of the properties of that variable called NM and I see that there's a property called refers to and you'll see here that this particular one happens to refer to pound REF exclamation point at the end. Um, if I run this a few more times, you'll see that we will get a true address when it's valid. So if I look at that rightmost four characters of the refers to property, I can probably customize this macro a little bit. So let me try it here. We'll say if the right of nm dot refers to comma four is equal to ref exclamation point, then we'll do the delete and if. So this way we're only going to delete the bad names from the list. Um, we'll run it. It just runs in less than a second. And now if we go back to insert name define, we should only be left with names that are valid and none of these will be reference errors. So a cool way to very quickly delete all either all names or just the invalid names from your workbook rather than doing it one at a time. Again, tiny little macro, either three lines or five lines, uh, but it certainly makes this process, which would have been painful, very, very quick. I want to thank Mike for sending it in. I want to thank you for stopping by. We'll see you next time for another netcast from Mr. Excel.